gentlemen, here we go. History will be made here tonight in Newcastle, Delaware. It's the 22nd annual ECWA oh. Super 8 tournament. Oh. Brady, you did a hell of a job up Thank there. Thank you. I was told I was going too slow, but I can only go as fast as the metal giver. <laughs> yeah, that is Who else we know was a little slow? <laughs> I'm just playing. I'm just playing. Uh, Phil, uh, what a prestigious tournament. So honored to be a part of this thing each and every year. And this year, certainly no different. Eight of the top independent talents in the world today. You're right. You know, I I had the privilege of refereeing, the two, being a part of the 2013 Super 8 tournament. I got to referee at least one match, so I go down the history books there. In the 2014, I was able to still be a part of the Super 8 tournament by being a manager in a non-tournament match. But... The last few years, I got to call color with you, and it's been a great experience ever since. And tonight, history will be made here. And look at this opening match we have here, Ty Awesome against Smiley. You know what, Phil? We're talking about up-and-comers, and certainly these two, two of the best uh, to be found on the East Coast. Smiley, of course, a trainee of the legendary Amazing Red. Uh, here's a guy who's gone toe-to-toe with his mentor on numerous occasions. And tonight, he draws ECWA's very own Ty Awesome. Ty, of course, making such waves in the industry, Phil. It's just a feeling in general that both these guys are going to have, <coughs> excuse me, long, successful careers. That's right. I've noted on numerous occasions that I was the first ever referee for Ty Awesome's first match. And he debuted, I believe, it was 2014. Yes. And right now... He's been on a tear in ECWA, and what a dream this is for him. I believe he's, he might be the youngest competitor in the Super 8 this year. And you know what, Phil? It's certainly such an achievement to be in this tournament less than four years into your career. I think it's tremendous. As Smiley absolutely punishing the youngster. Not that Smiley's uh, much older himself. Look at this springboard playing between the ropes. Flips him over and tie also nearly across the ring, Phil. Tell you what, you knew this was going to be an action packed match here. Oh, Ty Awesome! Missing the short oh, and Smiley does too. Both men up on our feet. And the crowd with a show of appreciation. Standing shooting star press, and he misses. You know, Phil, I was talking to Smiley a couple weeks ago on my podcast. Uh, here's a guy, I just didn't know which version of him we were going to get. Apparently, the sportsman like version in round one at least. Well, I'll tell you what, earlier in the match, Ty Awesome took off his mask and Smiley had another mask on underneath. <laughs> yeah. Well, do you, you think know, he's really smiling underneath that mask? I, I, I have no idea, Phil, but I do tell you this he certainly does come from a deranged place. Oh, look at the Smiley going to the floor. This, this, is, this is a good idea. That's a sign of sanity. We know Ty Awesome likes to fly. Well, I'll tell you what, Phil. Smiley is so intent on being the first masked star. But look at this. Smiley in the Super 8 tournament. From behind. Ty doesn't see him. Oh, catches him off guard and claps him in. Right, right over the ears. That'll, that'll mess with your uh, equilibrium. Off the ropes comes Smiley. Oh, Ty and Boss Insiguri. Not Insiguri. What is it? It's like, it's like a running... It's one time. Almost a cannonball like yes. this. And Ty Awesome right now is suffering. Ty Awesome, of course, also so so uh, excited, Phil, to be in this year's tournament. I'll tell you what, he, you know, his father, <laughs> is, it hasn't, his, the smile hasn't left his face today. We know he's such a proud man of his son and the, the accomplishments that his son has been doing in the short amount of time since he's been wrestling. It, it's such an honorable thing, Phil. And I, for me, it keeps coming back to Ty Awesome. In this very building in January, ECWA New Year's Resolutions, when Ty Awesome had no idea that he was going to be selected for the tournament, he just he lost a, a tough mid-Atlantic battle to our champion Chris Wilde and uh, was informed of his status in the tournament. Real emotion, Phil. Real joy. Yeah. Look at the excitement in this kid's eyes. Ducks the clothesline, does Smiley back out to the outside. And again, back under the ring. You never know where he's going to attack from. I think Ty's looking. Oh, look at this. The wrong way again sweeps the legs. 
smiling now. So unorthodox, Phil. Ooh. Beautiful swan time. One, two. Ooh. A tie also does kick out at two, but wow. It looks like you may have hurt his ribs there, Phil. Well, also, when he covered him for the pin, he was holding his neck a little bit. Your neck is not supposed to move like that. No, it's not. And that doubly bodes poorly for Ty Awesome because, of course, to win this tournament, he'll have to compete three times this evening. Yeah. You know, the thing about it's the guys who are in this tournament, the only thing they can do is literally watch YouTube's of the other guys who are in the tournament because when they come out, they don't know who their opponents are. Right. So and a lot of them are virtually unknown anyway. Yeah. So how could you get mentally prepared for a tournament like this? Uh, it, you know what? It's the uh, it's just be prepared for anything, anything and everything. Beautiful moonsault off the top there. Well, Ty Awesome got the knees up in the nick of time. Another factor we haven't even talked about for tonight, Phil. The first round matchup's all just 10 minutes long. That means this is a sprint to win this match as yeah. quickly as possible. Or you'll both be out. Ty Awesome got this crowd behind him. Getting ready to fly, I think. They're smiling back in the ring. Ty doesn't see him once again. How is he catching Ty Awesome off guard? That time he was ready, Phil, and he's going to fly. Whoa. Through the ropes. Beautiful drop kick. Smiley. Got back in the ring. Ty Awesome now. Off the ropes. He's flying four on the ropes again. Catches it with another Ty Awesome. This crowd's certainly behind him. Forced into the corner by Smiley. And Awesome's going to duck out of the way this time. Charges. Beautiful European uppercut. Follows it up with a forearm to the side of the head. Ty Awesome. He is flying now. Knees right down to the chin. And he's going to kip up, Phil. Ty Awesome, huge kick up those feet. Close. Again, now. Ty Awesome's going to have to find a way to get the three if he wants to move on here. Because two and a half will not get you there. Kicked to the head by Smiley. Bringing Ty Awesome to the floor. Now Smiley back inside the ring. Off the ropes goes Smiley. Suicide dive right into the clap crowd. The people in the front row there aren't the most agile either. I hope they're okay. Smiley going top row kill. This could be it. Smiley calling for it. Ty rolling out of the way. Smiley doesn't seem to care. Huge splash off the top row. Catches him anyway. And somehow Ty Awesome does find a way to kick out. What an incredible matchup this is, Brady. I knew it would be, Phil. When I saw this class, I just knew. Oh, beautiful. Oh, he can't get him. Kind of a modified Spicoli driver there. You know it's bad when I'm losing my voice in the first match. The crowd not unlike the dual personalities of Smiley. Channeling both sides of what he thinks. Smiley. Ty Awesome up to his feet. Dedicated this match to his poor Papa who passed away recently. Papa Smiley and of course Papa Awesome. Who's Frankensteiner? Ty now. In Ty Awesome's corner, his number one fan. Catches him with the name. Shining Wizard. He's calling for it, Phil. This could be the flipping awesome 450 splash. If he hits us, Phil, I have a feeling. Oh, that is, that is got to be it. Hooks the leg. Two. 
Oh, he got him! Wait.